Hey, we're talking love on Daily Bible Time. Dominic Steele here, Friday morning. What is love? We speak of falling in love or falling out of love. And look, I can say, going away with Catherine on holiday, I had a moment, a sense that I fell in love with her all over again. But I see people saying they love like that. And what they actually, when they say that, they mean love is the feeling, love is the butterflies, love is the excitement, love is the thrill of the chase, love is noticing that they've walked into the room Whereas actually, love is putting the other person's interest first, of acting in a way that is saying, I will do what is best for you over and ahead of what is best for me. And it is that attitude that Jesus has to me. Jesus has acted for my good over and above his good. Jesus died for me. That's the attitude flowing into action that we are to have for others in the Christian family to put on love. And when we put on love, Colossians 3, it's when we put on love that we'll be bound together. We'll be moving to help each other become more in the image of God. Friends, people say of us here at Village Church, Village Church, they, they say we're good at welcoming people who visit us at church. That's their first bite feel. That's their first bite sense of our relationship. They see the fellowship is good. It's positive. They, they find us warm and engaging. But the question for us, the ch challenge for us as a church is, yeah, we're good at giving that nice, warm, fuzzy feelings. But are we actually going to be able to follow through? Are we actually going to be able to love, to genuinely act for the good of the other? See, I could run it through for you as a list of virtues. Are you going to be compassionate? Are you going to be kind? I mean, these are the things that Paul listed earlier in Colossians 3. And you're going to do the acts of service. But it's, it's not just a matter of doing the particular thing. But it's, am I putting on the clothes of love? Am I acting in such a way that the other person might grow to maturity in Christ? Thanks for joining us for Daily Bible Time today. And I hope you'll join us tomorrow again. And look, you can subscribe to Daily Bible Time by going to bit.ly slash daily Bible Time.